Mohammed Mohammed married a six year old. He's a religious hate spills over at Dara. I can do what I want. Do you? Are you the boss of the whole world? After days of tension, I hate the religion of Islam. The man at the centre of the row, Pastor Logan Robertson, is a controversial Kiwi Baptist who set up his own church in Goodna. Be upon Muhammad. I'm serious. Be upon him. Preaching extreme views. That guy is a filthy reprobate. That's what Muhammad is. I'll do an impersonation of Muhammad for you. I say. I think these kind of people are white ISIS. Robertson has also called for gays to be shot in the head. Yesterday, he and his followers attended Karabi Mosque, whose members say they harassed a 15-year-old boy. It was a sissy. You, you talk to a 15-year-old kid like that? I mean, look but at your sissy size as well. Robertson says it was just a film. I want, want to make a documentary us? about your false religion. Do you religion? want to be violent? I want... Do you want to use no. terror and violence? It's not how it's making it. Do you it... want to be a terrorist? My fear is that. Before it was individuals on the corner, street corner, in the shopping centres. Now they've actually come inside a mosque. What's next? Today's confrontation ended when police asked the Baptists to leave. The Quran should be burned. It's a piece of But later, officers pulled them over for a roadside search. Now it appears police have decided to confiscate some of their camera equipment and the group are getting quite frustrated asking why it's being taken away. Robertson, though, isn't ruling out more mosque visits. Who knows? There might Please be. There might the not. Car, Tim, what are police doing about the growing tensions? Well, Melissa, I can tell you as well as the camera equipment, police have also seized the mobile phones from the Baptist group as they investigate whether any public nuisance, harassment or trespass offences have occurred. They're also stepping up patrols around mosques across the southeast to make sure they're safe. Melissa? Thank you. Queensland is watching the number one news hour.